Okay guys, welcome to Celtic Droid TV. Um, in this guide I'm going to show you how to add on some more channels to the iView guide. Okay, so um, it's pretty straightforward. We've just got to add in um, a new source to get these uh, new add-ons which will automatically integrate into the iView guide. Okay, so what we need to do, we need to go to uh, settings and as you can see there, um, just there, it, it's the file manager we need. So if you just click into file manager, and what you need to do is, as you see all these options here, okay, what we're looking to do is go down, find add source, and click OK. And it'll bring you to this. And what you need to do is just click into the none, and then what you need to do is put it in um, exactly as I do. So it's HTTP, hold on forward slash forward slash uh, trans, transform dot mega dash tron dot t okay so that's http colon forward forward slash transform dot mega dash tron t okay so once you've got that put in just click on done um, and then it'll ask you to enter the name. So you just click into that and then you just call it uh, Megatron. Okay, and then you just click done. So as you can see there, so you've clicked into that one, put that in, clicked into the name there. Okay, so all we do is click okay. And as you can see, it's added that into, into the folder there. So what you need to do is just come back out of that. So uh, click back, kind of brings you back to the settings. Okay, so uh, we're in the top menu, so just click settings and it will bring you to this screen. Okay, uh, what we need to do is go down to add ons here, okay, and just click into that. And it will give you these uh, this list. And what we need to do is install from a zip file, okay? So you just click on to install from a zip file, and now as you go down, you can see the Megatron folder that we just added as a source. Okay, so if you click into Megatron and you'll see it says add ons and repos. What we're looking for um, on this instance is actually repos. So if you click into repos and then as you can see, there's a load of different uh, repos. The one we are looking for is the repository pod god and it's the 1.3 zip. So all you need to do is highlight it and click OK. And as you can see, that will work in the background. So if we just wait for that, and as you can see up there, um, the Prodog repo is actually enabled. Uh, so that's perfect. Now, what we need to do there is uh, we need to get the actual individual um, add ons from that repository. We're looking for channel pair, C, C Cloud. Okay, so if you go to the next step, which is install from the repository. It brings you all the repositories here, okay? So if you just um, scroll down, and what we're looking for is the Pogods repo. So there we go. So you just highlight that, this repo here, and you just click into that, and it brings you to this. So what we're looking for now is the video add ons, okay? Now, as you can see, these are the ones we're looking for. Um, now, to be honest, we can just add in all of them. So you just, just do that again. So you've highlighted it and you click OK and it brings to this screen and you just go down to install, which is here. Okay, so you can just click into that and that will actually install Canada Live TV. You'll see a pop up at the top in two seconds and there we go. So you do the same for C Cloud. Install and that will do that. And again, you just click down and click at the channel pair and install. Okay, so we just wait for that to pop up here, and it will jump there as well. So, once you've done that, you can literally just come out, okay? And it will actually be, if you go to the add-on zone, just go down and across to video add-ons, click in there, it actually takes you behind the scenes, if you like. And these are all the actual individual individual add-ons. So as you can see there, we've now installed Canada Live TV and you look for this C Cloud TV as well. Okay, so and there's channel pair. So they've all installed so we'll just just and there we go. So you've got all your channels 
Okay, now, um, these will be um, integrated into Ivy. Okay, so we'll come back out to that now. Now. I will do another video now. Once once you've installed that, the next video will actually show you uh, some common fixes and some common stuff to do with our view if you have any instance. Okay, so I will uh, log off now and do another video. We will, uh, if you've got any problems, just contact us through the website or uh, Twitter or Facebook and we'll get this sorted.